This is a great question and a topic that I see a lot of confusion over. So basically what oil you're going to use is going to depend on your application. You want to make sure the smoke point is high enough for the application you're using it for. If not, you're essentially going to degrade the oil and you're essentially burning the oil, which you don't want. So for a high heat application like frying, you'll want to use something like canola oil, peanut oil, safflower oil, refined olive oil, not extra virgin because refined has a higher smoke point. Some other options would be safflower oil, avocado oil, or uh, vegetable oil, which is typically just soybean oil. Obviously what you choose is going to depend on your taste preferences as well. If you want a more neutral oil, I would go with canola or soybean. If you like the flavor of something like peanut oil uh, and you're not allergic, obviously, um, you could use that too. All right, so for in baking applications, typically you're going to want a more neutral oil. You typically don't want the flavor to be imparted when you're baking. So canola or vegetable oil are great for baking applications. Sauteing can handle a little bit lower temperatures. So extra virgin olive oil, safflower oil, canola oil. Again, if you like the taste, peanut oil or sesame oil can be used as well. In an application that's not heated at all, like a dressing, obviously um, any liquid oil will work. So if you like the taste of extra virgin olive oil, that works. Um, you can also use a neutral oil in a dressing application as well. For something really high heat like popcorn, you're going to want to use a refined sunflower oil, avocado oil, a refined coconut oil. Refining actually increases the smoke point. You'll see that the refined versions of all the different oils are going to have higher smoke points because the refining process increases the smoke point. The thing that makes this topic even more confusing than it needs to be is all of the misinformation regarding different vegetable oils. I've seen some misinformation saying that refined oils are rancid. That is not true. Pick which ones work for your applications and the ones that you prefer the taste of. Don't be afraid to try different oils too. If you can't afford extra virgin olive oil, try a virgin olive oil or pure olive oil. They're going to be a little bit more neutral in taste, but they could work for you and they're less expensive. You also don't have to stick to one or two different oils. You can try different ones out. You can have a few different ones in your cabinet for different applications and different dishes.